tools this time of year, maybe do some home improvement projects. And for those of you who can't afford to buy new tools, there's a local nonprofit called the Tool Library that actually helps you save money on tools. That's where we find our 7 Eyewitness News reporter, Twila Nugent, live for us in University Heights. Hi, Twee. Good morning, Anna and Katie. How many times have you ever wanted to do a project but realized you didn't have the tools and you didn't want to buy them because you'd probably only use them once? Well, this is the perfect place for you. It's the University Heights Tool Library. Darren, you're the tool library guy. Tell us a little bit about what it is you do. Sure. Uh, so just like you said, people maybe have a tool that they need one time on a project. They don't want to spend $200 on it. Uh, they can come to the tool library for just $20 a year. They can uh, borrow up to five tools at a time for up to a week at a time. So basically, you need a tool, you use it on a project, you bring it back, take something else out. So very similar to a regular library, um, but you're borrowing tools, and we've got about 2,500 tools uh, for people to choose from. And this is actually really just a really good way to bring the community together, right? Because your membership is all across the board. Yeah, exactly. We have people coming from all over Buffalo, West Side, East Side, North Buffalo, South Buffalo, um, all the surrounding suburbs. And yeah, it's really just a great place for all sorts of different people to sort of come together. Um, we do tons of community projects. So aside from, you know, hanging a bookshelf or uh, remodeling your bathroom, we also have community groups, block clubs, planting trees, uh, removing graffiti, putting up public art, um, turning vacant lots into community gardens. So really, the beautiful thing about the Tool Library is that it's a platform to do so many different things and it's always changing. You've been able to grow a lot over the years too, right? Yeah, so we started you know, with a handful of tools and a handful of members and we're almost at a thousand members today and like I said, we have 2,500 tools. Uh, if people wanna check out our inventory, it's actually all online, so if they visit us at thetoollibrary.org, they can actually search in real time, see what's in, see what's checked out. Um, so if there's a particular tool they're looking for, they can do that. Absolutely, and I do want to mention this is entirely volunteer-based, so it's an incredible, A, community group, and B, way for you to get involved here as well, just by supporting the community library, but also beautifying the community that we all live in and share. We're live here in the University Heights neighborhood. I'm Twilon Nugent, 7 Eyewitness News. Twilon, thanks. I have a tool lover at home who's always trying to buy more tools. I'm going to send him to the tool library. 20 bucks a year. Save you a couple bucks, Exactly. Huh? That's a great deal.